Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name's Ariel. Um, today is kind of just a little by the title, you guys probably know anyway, but it's just like a prep and pack with me vlog. Um, today is Friday and in a week I leave for vacation and I think by now you guys will know where I'm going so this is a prep and pack with me for Hawaii. I'm so excited. Right now I'm just pulling into the parking lot to go get my hair done. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to take you guys along with me while I prep and then I'll show you guys like what I pack and everything like that. But this is the before of my hair and I am going to leave so blonde, I already know it. I'm seeing Caitlyn who I've seen before um, and yeah, I'm super excited. So I just wanted to start off this vlog and I will show you guys the after. You guys, this is the final product. I can show you guys later like when I get back home and stuff. Um, but yeah, I just got it done and it looks so good. Um, I just got like more blonde and stuff, but she did like a different technique and I love the way it turned out. It's like the perfect blonde and I love it. Um, but right now Jordan's actually driving behind me and we are running to um, the mall and we're actually gonna get some facials at Sephora. And I think that doing it um, like a week before we leave is probably like a safe, like the safest option. Like that's why we're doing it a week before we leave. Just in case we do have any like breakouts or our skin reacts to it, um, we'll have some time for it to like maybe go away before we leave. But yeah, I will show you guys what like the facial is and stuff when we get there. I'm pretty excited. Um, it's like the Hydra facial, I guess is what it's called. So yeah, that's pretty much that and I'm gonna put my camera down so I can drive. I think this is the final product. I was able to take out a few things. Um, but like I said, I overpack. It's just what I do. I can't help it. Um, this stuff I'm going to be wearing on the plane. So take that out of the equation. And all of this stuff right here has to fit in this suitcase. Um, so we'll see. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to bring some workout clothes here. Um, some socks. These are all of like my dressy tops. A skirt and a dress. Um, then I have shorts here two longer pairs of pants, just a sweater to throw on over any of those tops if I get cold. I have just this little backpack in case I want to bring it on a hike or something. Then I have my beach bag under here with all of my accessories, a raincoat because you never know, it can just start raining at any point. Um, and then I have like all of my makeup and stuff like that. And then all of these bags right here are bathing suits. I have like 12 bathing suits in there. Don't ask, I'm going for like a week but it's okay and then I just have some extra sweatshirts and I still need to add um like shorts and a shirt for pajamas um but yeah I'm just gonna try and put all of this stuff in some packing cubes and we'll see if it fits so I finished packing up my suitcase and I was able to get everything in the suitcase but I can't seem to zip it so that's gonna be an issue. Um, it like, like it like doesn't zip. So we're gonna have to rearrange that at some point, but yeah. And that's just like all of my clothes, which is kind of embarrassing, but like whatever. My shoes aren't in it. And then I also have like a bunch of toiletries right here that aren't in there yet because we do have a different suitcase for shoes and toiletries um, just because our suitcases that we have to bring are kind of small, so. Yep, so that's that. Um, that stinks that I can't close this. Now I'm going to have to worry about that at a different time. Take on my carry-on, which is this bag right here. And I kind of just threw a bunch of stuff in here so that I wouldn't forget it. Um, I got it from TJ Maxx, um, which is actually it's a pretty nice bag. Um, it's a fossil bag right there. And it's just a good size duffel bag. Um, I didn't really have one to bring on the plane. So for the plane ride, I actually have two neck pillows that I bought. I just bought this one that is going to go around my neck and I like it because it has higher sides so it really keeps my neck in one spot and it's like a really nice pillow. And then I bought a second one just because I didn't know if I would like this one and also I like to have one to sit on. That sounds like I'm an old person but I like to just bring one of these to sit on if um, I start to get uncomfortable after a little while. I'm back in a tank top because I'm sweating. Um, 
after trying to get my suitcase to zip and it just wasn't working but um i wanted to show you guys what i got from sephora the other day when i went to get my facial um and overall it was really nice the facial itself um i would totally do it again and i would recommend it to you guys i'm breaking out of my forehead but i was breaking out before that facial so um it's not from that so don't worry <laughs> um but it was really nice my face felt so smooth after Jordan I don't think has ever gotten a facial and she went when I went and she said that it was so good she's like if I need to um buy anything from Sephora again tell me to wait so that I can like rack up um like the money or whatever and buy multiple things at once so that she can do the facial so yeah that's a long story but i wanted to tell you guys that it's definitely worth it um i really loved it a lot they did like the um like it's like a hydrofacial but they call it something different so it was really cool to see like what came out of my skin which is kind of gross but yeah i want to show you guys what i got from sephora because i'm going to bring them on the plane in my carry-on all right so when i went to sephora i picked up this summer fridays um jet lag mask and it's just the mini version um just because I wanted to be able to bring it on the plane to do while we're in the air. Um, and this is supposed to be a really, like, moisturizing mask that I can just, like, leave on if I want to. Um, so yeah, that's why I got that. Then I picked up this Way um, Wave Spray, just because I'm not sure how much I'm going to be able to do my hair when I'm on vacation. And I know that I'm going to be in and out of the water and the ocean, and it'll probably rain, so I can just spray this in my hair, throw it in, like, my beach bag, and be good to go. Alright, the next thing I got are just these Peter Thomas Roth Cucumber Detox Hydrogel Eye Patches. Um, and I'm going to bring these on the plane to hydrate like under my eyes so my face doesn't feel like so gross. And just to like wake me up a little bit and make me not feel like I've been on a plane for 11 hours. So yeah, I got these and these actually had pretty good ratings but you just like throw them under your eyes. Um, and... Yeah, it's going to keep them super moisturized, and they come with a lot of patches in here. I think it says, yeah, 30, um, so I can use them 30 times. There's 30 different ones in here, um, so yeah, I'm really excited to use these. Then I ordered this online. This is just the Slip Pure Silk Sleep Mask, and this was a little, I don't know, like, I just really wanted to have this when I was on the plane, so it is just this beautiful silk eye mask and I don't know I'm super excited to wear this it's so soft and this is really good like silk in general is good for your skin um they always say to like sleep on silk pillowcases but those are an investment so I started with this um and I'm super excited to just curl up on the plane and wear this Blueberry muffin on what? my carpet. Ew. Who put blueberry muffin in my car? I oh wait, I did. Ew. I did. It was with the Jordan now, and we just got to the nail salon. We're about to get pedicures. Um, we were just jamming to some Jonas Brothers. If you're ever in the need for a throwback, go on Apple Music if you have it and play the Disney Channel. What's it called? I think it's called like Disney Channel Music. Disney Channel Music. It's like a radio station. It's bomb. It has so many good songs from like when like people my age were kids um, and like used to watch like Camp Rock and um, like Lizzie McGuire and stuff like that. It's a few days later. I just got back from a final. That's why I look like this. Um, but I am finishing up packing now a little later than I wanted to. But I kind of just wanted to show you guys the situation because I ended up having to switch out my suitcase um i ended up using a bigger suitcase um this one's my dad's actually so thanks dad but now i'm able to kind of just fit all of my stuff and it's gonna fit really well and we're checking the bags either way so the size doesn't really affect much other than now my dad has my small one and i got to use this one and this is all the stuff now i'm just finalizing up my carry-on bag which is this bag right here that I was showing you guys a few clips ago um, but yeah all of my 
devices and stuff are charged. I have so many cords. I need to go through these um, and see which ones I really need. Um, all of this stuff is going in my carry-on too. So I have this and it just kind of has like my teas, um, some Motrin and inhaler and then some other stuff in here. Um, and then this is kind of like my skincare pouch. And I just have like face masks, um, like blotting sheets, lip balms, deodorant, a few scrunchies, um, just stuff that I'm going to be using on the plane. My sunglasses, I don't need this because I have a little travel one. But yeah, this is my wallet, I have my glasses, this is going to be where all of my cords go. This hydro flask is empty so that I can fill it up after um, I go through. TSA that's Jordan screaming in the background and like I showed you guys before my two neck pillows that I'm going to be bringing So this is kind of the overview of what's going to go in here And then right now I just have my blanket some fuzzy socks and my eye mask um, And then I actually have a pair of flip-flops and shorts in there But yeah, this is kind of what I'm working with right now. All right, you guys I just showered and finished packing um, so the situation ended up being that I'm taking this suitcase, which is actually 45 pounds, so I made it under the 50 pound limit, so I have that. And then I have my carry-on here with my two pillows, so I was able to fit everything, and yeah, that's really good, so hopefully all goes well. Oh, by the way, the luggage that we use is the Away luggage. Just, it's just like that and they're hard shell they're really nice um i found this online and or i found the brand online and then my parents ended up buying the luggage from there and they're super cool because you can lock them at the top and stuff so i highly recommend that but yeah i'm really happy that i was able to fit everything oh and yesterday i didn't end up getting my nails done jordan and i went and i just got um white um like powder dip on my fingers so i think that's it for this vlog um i am staying overnight tonight in boston my family and i are gonna leave the house pretty soon to head to just a hotel near the airport so that we don't have to um drive all the way to boston in the morning so yeah we're gonna do that and then i'm gonna start a new vlog tomorrow so get excited for the hawaii vlogs i can't wait to be there um i'm actually kind of excited for the plane ride too don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet and turn your post notifications on so you can see and get notified when i post next because the next few videos are going to be hawaii vlogs and they're going to be so cool i can already like see it i have a bunch of ideas and stuff like that also follow my instagram it's always linked in the description box down below if you want to see um some of the outfits and stuff that i packed um and like my instagram stories and stuff like that and i think that's it i think so thanks again for watching i'll see you guys in my next one bye